crankshaft damper. Every time an injector fires, you get torsional twisting. And it wants to try, it, and the piston comes down, the connecting rod bottoms out, but it wants to twist the crankshaft. Okay. It's similar to, to getting this. It takes the beat. Right. So if I continue to do this for about a week, we'd probably break your wrist. Well, this is what's happening. Have a blood That's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have to have somebody hold that one out. <laughs> so anyway. So quit doing this. <laughs> Torsional twisting is a bad thing. Torsional twisting will break crankshafts, camshafts, accessory drives. It'll play great. Um, alternator brackets, air conditioning, compressor brackets, flywheel bolts, flywheel housing bolts. Then we'll even knock the springs out of a clutch disc. This moves back and forth violently as this is spinning on the engine. And you can see this Teflon bearing right here. Right. This Teflon bearing allows this to move, but in here you can see the free space. Yep. They pump silicone in there through this little port it's held on there for 30 minutes to 15 PSI to make sure that it's completely filled with silicone. Well, as this Teflon starts to go bad, it impregnates the silicone. Silicone gets hard. This can no longer move back and forth. No. It's a gradual effect. It's like a shock absorber wear. You know, it just, some days say, boy, it's just not as smooth as it used to be. to change it about half a million They start to fail at about 380, but it's a gradual failure up to 500,000. Then we make the balance room go on behind it because this takes out portion of twisting, this takes out imbalance of the transmission of the clutch. So I guess we'll do them both the same, right? Yep. Same time. They're both the same time. On a cat, this is 490, and that's 225. It is a crankshaft damper. Ours are made in the USA by the original crankshaft damper manufacturer. They started in 1948. Cummins, Cat, Detroit, Mack all jumped ship and they went overseas to get them cheaper. We stayed with the USA manufacturer and this is the balancer.